How you doing, Seattle? I can't imagine a better group that I would rather have on my side, so I want to thank you so much. I am from Ohio, and we've got a few good things beginning in Ohio. Of course, I've been working on this for a long time. But we have a couple different ballot initiatives going on, or attempting to go on, that we're gathering signatures for. And then we also have a medical marijuana bill that I have personally helped write. Um, my whole life I have not been heard. When I was a little girl, I couldn't speak until I was five. I finally found my voice. You guys have given me the courage to find my voice. I have a laundry list of things going on with my body, but let me first give you a little background on Tanya. Tanya Davis does not have a criminal record. Tanya Davis is not a drug addict. Tanya Davis has uh, just found out that I have massive calcium deposits that are on my brain. Two weeks ago, I was hospitalized. So the laundry list don't even matter anymore. You know, I got all past that. I've learned to deal with that. But the massive calcium deposits on my brain, it's not like I have cancer and I can go have chemotherapy. And they'll take it away. My calcium deposits are causing severe brain damage. And before anyone makes any comments, no, I have never done methamphetamine. Um, so that is not the cause. <laughs> I just found out that causes crystallization or something. Someone made a smart ass remark, so. But I am not about all that. What I am about is fighting for my right to use this medicine. I choose to eat it. I am a medical marijuana patient, and I choose to eat my medicine. Okay, back to the calcium deposits on my brain. It's causing severe damage. And medical marijuana may be the only thing that can save my life or give my part of my brain that isn't covered in calcium a chance to protect itself. So I truly, with all my heart, if you need a reason to stand up for what's right, use me. Please use me because I believe I can be utilized in this movement in a positive way. And that's honestly, you know, when they told me that I was gonna speak on this wonderful main stage, I was scared to death. But then I got to thinking in my mind, hell, I'm just talking to a few hundred of my own friends, 200,000 of my own friends. So. That got over that a little bit, but I'm still scared to death, guys. We love you! We love you! We love you! I... I love you, too. Um, marijuana might be the only thing that'll give me a fighting chance. And I'd be damned if our federal government is going to stop me from making this choice because don't I deserve to have a fighting chance at that? Yeah. You guys just gave me chill bumps, by the way. It's the right thing to do. Bottom line. And yes, so what if it makes you feel better? If you're not a patient. So fucking what? Yeah. Thank you for having me in Seattle. Thank you. Please go 
to uh, look me up, Tanya Davis, Ohio, in, on Facebook. Friend me. Uh, find out what's going on with me, if you want. But I promise you that until I have my very last breath, I'm going to continue to fight. God bless you and thank you.